Hi there, this is Mark McRae, and I've been helping businesses grow their revenue and get more clients for over 20 years. And one of the things they never tell you in the, in the textbooks is that as an entrepreneur, as a small business owner, your psychological state is probably one of the most important things to the welfare and to the future of your business. So, I mean, if you go in, if you're in a bad place psychologically, it's very hard to motivate yourself and everybody around you to make things happen. In fact, I would go as far as saying that 80% of what happens in your business is down to your psychological state. Because there are days where you go in there and nothing happens. You're really just peddling, you know, kicking water. There's, there's nothing really, you know, there's no momentum, there's no drive, there's nothing that the team can see in you that would inspire them to go farther themselves. So where you are psychologically is very important to the to how your business prospers. And I know that not everybody can have a perfect day, wake up and feel full of beans and you know, wants to be uh, an inspiration to the world. There will be bad days. But the majority of the time, you've got to figure out what's going to get you in the right frame of mind to make things happen inside your business. Maybe it's going to the gym. Maybe it's doing yoga, maybe it's doing breathing exercises, but whatever it is, you have to go in there and think, I always think of yourself as, you know, a lot of the people I work with earn more than some of the top athletes and some of the, you know, the, the movie stars, they're, they're, they're earning phenomenal amounts of money and yet they treat themselves and, uh, you know, psychologically, physically, emotionally, they have problems. Everybody has problems. But if you think of your uh, a top athlete, he would never think of eating out four or five times a week and never exercising and then wake up and expect to, to perform at their, their very best. And it's like that for a business. You have to think of yourself as like a top athlete. How would that athlete, you know, uh, approach their week? They would plan it. They would have their diet worked out, they would have their exercise routine worked out, they would figure out how to get themselves into that top state. And as a top business person, it's no more or less important. So how you are psychologically will impact your business. So try and always approach your business in a great psychological state. If you'd like to work with me, work with me you can reach me at markmccray.com. Thanks for listening.